All right, well, 619 is our time now. Uh, this is a KCR3 weather impact day, and we are still talking triple digits. We are, and before we get there, I've got a stunner of a shot to show you. Okay. Though. I'll tell you what, if you're brushing your teeth, eating your breakfast. Wow, pretty. Drop the toothbrush, come to the TV screen, check this out. This is coming in from our Sutter Buttes Sky Camera. And I know for much of the northern Sacramento Valley, we've had just really that degraded air quality in the past couple of days and weeks for that matter. Now look at that gorgeous burst of color as the sun is rising there. And you can see just kind of the peak there of part of the Buttes as we look off in the distance. It's a gorgeous morning start. Getting after 50s right now here in Sacramento. 66 out the door in Stockton. 69, you've backed down in Modesto, down to that upper 60s range. And right now into Lake Tahoe, currently it's 47 degrees. Now the day ahead looks like this. Comfortable throughout the morning, so on a day that we know we're heading into the impactful heat. It's always advised to get out and enjoy the morning, whether it's tending to your yard work or the garden, walking the dog. I know it's a Monday. We're getting back into that morning routine. We're in the mid 80s by lunchtime. You start to feel the warmth building and then by three o'clock in the afternoon we hit our high at about 100 degrees and we're still pretty warm even through six and seven o'clock in the evening as we're in those upper 90s. Today in the foothills, plan to see mainly sunny skies, occasional haze on uh, on some occasion as the wildfire smoke drifts in and out of view. We're looking at mid 90s today for lunchtime temperature in the foothills and highs today peaking in the upper 90s. In your Sierra planner, it is going to be a, another warm afternoon, feeling very summer like still in the mountains. 75 for you by lunchtime, mid 80s by three o'clock and the breeze will pick up beyond noon as those southwest southwest winds start to churn. So for today and also looking ahead to Tuesday and Wednesday, we're going to be feeling the heat and that's impactful heat with hazy sun expected on occasion and late week cooling coming our way. High pressure again, the dominant feature, the biggest influencer through midweek and then watch what happens by Thursday and Friday shrinks down, moves off to the east. A system drops down from the north that sets us up for the drop in temperatures by late week. So the heat have a plan ahead for the next three days, at least with the impact and then eventually by the weekend we'll back down to those mid 90s.